How's it going you guys? New Age here with episode 81 of our live showdown battles using our gym leader teams. So this week we're using Morty's team and this is going to be the last video for this week. And our current record is 36 wins, 53 losses. We won 2 out of the 3 of our battles that we've had so far. So uh, let's see if we can maybe get 3 wins for this week because we haven't done that in a while. Let alone win throughout the whole week. I mean damn. Everything's just so depressing, but not really. So here we go. Let's see if we can get ourselves a third win. So we're going up against Cloyster, Licky Licky, Meganium, Crobat, Alakazam, and Chandelure. And damn it, another Chandelure. Chandelure messes up my team so bad. Uh, I'm not sure what he's starting with. I want to say maybe Crobat. Uh, they could start with Chandelure too if they're just trying to go straight for it. But you know what? Uh, I think I can start off with Chandelure too because I'm Scarfed, I hit Chandelure, Alakazam, Crobat, Meganium, and Cloyster. The only one I don't hit is Licky Licky and if he starts off with that, I'll just switch out. I'm not too afraid of that. So let's let's try starting off with Chandelure and see how well we can do. So they do start off with their Chandelure. I'm Scarfed, they might be Scarfed. I'm just going to go for a Shadow Ball and we take it out. Oh, thank God one that we don't have to worry about. Now, we do still have to worry about Alakazam. I am worried about that one a little bit. And then Cloyster, uh, I just have to, I mean, yeah, <laughs> it's okay. He forfeited. So there you go, guys, we win. I'm just kidding. I wish they would have stayed. I wish it was that easy, because now we're taking on a harder team, it looks like. So we've got Luxray, Gardevoir, Charizard, Breloom, Lucario, and Togekiss. Um, damn it. I want to start off with Trepanet to take on the Breloom. But if they start off with Charizard, that may put me in a bad place. Then again, I have Chandelure. But then they have a lot of potential Megas. Charizard? Charizard's probably their Mega. Or Gardevoir. I doubt it's Lucario. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and start things off with Trevenant. So they start off with Luxray, uh, which sucks because if anyone wants to take take an Ice Fang, it's more Gorgeist uh, than anyone else. And it could be Guts, which I really want to avoid that. So it has Night Slash, it doesn't do too much. I hope <sighs> we don't miss the Leech Seed. Damn it, and I didn't even mean to click Shadow Claw. Wow. Okay. Cool. Beans. For us, so uh, there goes Trevenant. I wanted to leech seed the Luxray, but uh, I guess it's just not that easy, huh? So we got a Shuckaberry. Let's, uh, I guess now let's go for the leech seed. See, it would have been so much better to start off with Gorgeist. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. So I'm just gonna go for Protect. What? The <laughs> okay, well, whatever. I was doing bad there, anyways. You know what? Normally I would take this kind of thing out, but I'll, I'll leave it in, just so you can enjoy a whole bunch of nonsense. <laughs> you can experience what I had to go through. So, we are going up against that Gengar, who is sneakily concealed behind the Metagross. Uh, Metagross, Garchomp, Alakazam, Swampert, and Luxray. Uh, so, a pretty, pretty beefy, threatening team here, but uh, we'll see what we could do. We'll see what we could do. I'm assuming... Marsh Stomp is what, or Marsh Stomp, Swampert is what they're starting off with. Um, so I can start off with Chandelure, which also works because I can hit uh, Metagross, Gengar, Garchomp, and Alakazam. So I'm going to go ahead and start off with Chandelure. So I do start off with Gengar. I do fear the Focus Sash, but let's go for it anyways. Oh, no Focus Sash, not bad. So Gengar is gone, um, now I probably will have to switch out because I doubt they'll go into another Pokemon this week, just Shadow Ball. I'm um, assuming may maybe Metagross, or probably Garchomp, uh, since they can hit me with Earthquake. No, they go for Swampert, uh, just as good too. They probably had to know that I was a choice then, uh, if they're going out into Swampert. So, I actually, you know what, Jalison wants to take on Swampert way more than Gorgeist. Kind of. Not really. I think I'm going to go into Configurgus. I could take the physical hits, and I could burn it. I did want to go out into uh, Gorgeist, but uh, you know what? I figured Configurgus could do it uh, just as well 
with the paint split and the will o wisp and everything. So uh, let's let's try that out. So we're gonna go for a will o wisp here, and uh, we take the earthquake pretty well. And they are faster than me, so I'm gonna go ahead and go for a. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go for a pan split. I should be fine because I'm gonna take damage first, so it should heal me up a little bit. And then I'm gonna go ahead and switch uh, out into Gorgeist now. Now that Swampert's burned, uh, I definitely should be able to take this thing on. And then I'm gonna try and at uh, least seed up and all that good stuff. So it goes for Avalanche. So I actually went for. A nice time move, but since it's burned, we take that really well. And uh, I'm gonna go go ahead and go for Leech Seed here. Um, I could kill this thing with Seed Bomb, but the more health I can end up with in the end, the better. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna stick with that. So I'm gonna go for Protect right here, and they end up not switching out. So oh, okay, so they're getting the Stealth Rocks off before they go down. Oh, that sucks because if I was faster. Am I faster? Oh, uh, no. Okay, so then they would have got Stealth Rocks up either way. So a uh, Swampert's gonna go down. Uh, I'm assuming either Alkazam or Luxray. Okay. I'm cool with the Luxray. Uh, I take the physical hits pretty well. So I'm gonna try and hit it with the Will-O-Wisp, get it burned. And it just has Intimidate, which is weird because the last Luxray... Okay, good. The last Luxray, if you guys saw, uh... It was, there was a, uh, I can't even talk right now, it showed uh, different abilities, it showed Guts and Rivalry as well. So we do hit it with the Burn and the Leech Seed, so I can also use Protect now, uh, don't know if they're going to try and switch out. So we get a little extra health left, or a little, little extra health back, I just cannot talk sometimes, I don't know why. And uh, do more damage to the Luxray. So. This should kill them between uh, Burn and Leech Seed this turn, so I'm going to try and go for Protect one more time. Play it a little risky. Nope. Okay. If it would have worked, that would have been amazing, but we'll still get a little bit of health left regardless, or a little bit of health back from Luxray, and uh, we're doing pretty well. Pretty sure we've got this one. Uh, I think I'm just going to just gonna let Alkazam go, or Alkazam let Gorgeist go. I'm gonna go for Protect, just see what it's trying to do real quick. <sighs> and if I can somehow uh, try and burn or leech seed it, just so I can ensure that it has Magic Guard. Just to kind of remind myself, I guess. And uh, Chandelure should be able to take that down. So it does have Shadow Ball. I don't I actually don't think I'll go into Chandelure first. Cause Chandelure does have Hidden Power Ice for Garchomp. Then again, Jellicent has Ice Beam. Even though Jellicent's more especially defensive. So I'm gonna go for Leech Seed here, and Shadow Ball is gonna take us out. Uh I think I, I'd rather have Chandelure for uh, Garchomp than Jellicent. Yeah, Jellicent should be able to take on uh, Alkazam pretty well. A nice special bulk. So I'm going to go for Shadow Ball here. Uh, it does hit everything else on his team, so if I get stuck in that, I'm cool too. Or if he switches. Whoa. Okay. That was an extremely convenient crit right there. Uh, I'm just going to have to go out into Chandelure now. This sucks though, because I don't have that much for a Garchomp. But then again, Configure Gist can take on Garchomp if I really need it to. So I'm going to go for Shadow Ball here. Should take it out. I should be faster. Uh, I know he's not choice because he switched moves. And if he wants to switch out, that's fine. Because hitting something twice with Shadow Ball is going to be just fine with me too. So it does have a Focus Sash, uh, unfortunately. So it is going to take me out. I don't like where this is going. So Trevenant has the next best special defense. Which I guess if anything I need that one the least. So hopefully I can take a hit. And take out this Alkazam. Trevenant I really need you to take a hit for me. Come on. 
I'm pretty sure max HP, max special defense, right? Oh yeah, alright, we're good. Psy Shock. Why? Just because I'm specially defensive doesn't mean it's better to go for Psy Shock. So we'll see who he's going out into next. Uh, if Garchomp has Fire Fang, it could one-shot me. It could probably one-shot me with a Dragon Claw or Outrage. Metagross, I'm not so sure how well it could one-shot me, but uh, we'll see when it's got. Yeah, Earthquake doesn't kill. Oh, please hit it with Burn. Please hit it with Burn. Please hit it with Burn. Thank you. Uh, I can actually take another Earthquake now, I'm pretty sure. Actually, what am I doing? I should be using Rest. Oh, there we go. Uh, yeah, so we we got this one. We got this one pretty well. Got the Lumberry. Got the Burn on Metagross. Gonna hit it up with the Leech Seed now. And we get our Lumberry back. Completely forgot that I could use Rest. <laughs> but, I mean, whatever. That works too. I didn't die from the Earthquake. I, I feel the forfeit coming soon. But uh, if they do forfeit, that's fine, because we already know now that we've won this one. As Ice Punch, why didn't it use that first? What? Wow. That was a pretty big mess up. I could have easily taken out Trevenant. But I mean, whatever. So, Earthquake, I'm gonna go for Shadow Claw. And uh, now Metacross is dead. So, not bad. And we get the Leech Seed before the burn, so that's cool too. So, last, all we got is Garchomp, and uh, we're going to go ahead and attempt to burn that thing, too, and wow. Okay, good. We got it burned. So, no matter what, we we pretty much got this now. Um, I'm going to go for rest, I guess. I mean, I, I was still dead either way. And uh, now, we'll just go ahead and go out into Configurgus and let it finish things up. This Garchomp really can't do anything to me. The most they could even have is Crunch, and that's that's not going to do anything. And he's hitting himself in confusion. And we got the special defense drop, but not really. That would have been crazy. Just all the... everything piling on top of it. So, uh, yeah, this guard chomp is gone now, so that's going to be a good game. And we ended up winning three times this week. Not bad. So, uh, if, if, if you're hyped... For the triple wins that we've got this week, uh, almost almost had four. I mean, not really. That one that we lost, we weren't anywhere near close to winning. But three wins in a week, haven't done that in a long time. So uh, good job, Morty. And if you're looking forward to more of our battles next week using Chuck's team, go ahead and leave a like. If you want to see more, you can subscribe to my channel, New Age Steel, where I upload multiple videos every single day. You can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter, where I post first-hand information on when I upload videos to the channel. So until then, I'm New Age Steel, keep on watching, and I'll see you guys next time.